On a normal day, Stephanie Boismanu is removing aquatic invasive species on her own. But today she asked for some help. I love teaching kids about aquatic invasive species. Fourth grade students from the Arborvita Woodruff Elementary School joined Stephanie and other environment advocates in Woodruff. Students learned all about aquatic invasive species and even took a hands-on approach. Brandy Lake currently does not have any management plans, so it's, uh, it's really helping this lake out with these students getting into the lake and actually pulling out the Eurasian water milfoil. This is Eurasian water milfoil, which is one of the aquatic invasive species the fourth graders were looking for at Brandy Lake today. Eurasian water milfoil is one of the most common aquatic invasive species taking over lakes in northern Wisconsin. The invasive species can disrupt recreational activities from swimming to boating and kills native aquatic plants. Fourth grader Aza Bruett says she loves learning about how to keep lakes healthy. I'm excited because I like to find stuff new because really I haven't seen that type of stuff yet but looking at it will probably be a lot really like cool. Aza learned a lot from Nick Johnson who sees Eurasian water milfoil on a daily basis. The invasive species are a, a very big issue. Um, not every lake has them but that's because people are vigilant about um, preventing that from happening. Johnson owns a company called Aquatic Plant Management which uses several techniques to get rid of invasive species in lakes. This is Eurasian water milfoil. Um, it looks pretty similar to some of the native milfoils that we have in the lakes, but there's a couple distinguishing characteristics. Aquatic invasive species specialists like Johnson and Boismanu say while there are still invasive species in many lakes, every little action makes a difference. Especially when you can inspire the next generation of environmentalists. Having a field day like this is a great opportunity to really spread your wings and let them explore the things that you've been working with them. Reporting for Newswatch 12 in Woodruff, I'm Morgan Johnson. Not a whole lot. Last year we were finding a lot of oh, yeah. oil in here, but this year we're not. But you could see the look at here the different colors.